Brian Kenny, Jason Stark, and Rob Dibble. It's baseball tonight. Tell you, Keith Osick was some pitcher for Sh Shoreham Wading River back on Long Island. Here he is, that firing. Pick it off Sammy Sosa in the seventh in a tie ball game. He's playing because Jason Kendall was resting up for one day. There'd be more from Osick. Next pitch. Josh Fogg throwing. Alex Gonzalez hits that. Ryan Giles fights it off, makes the grab. Cubs don't score. Tie game. Bottom of the seventh. Men on second. Ramos Ramirez. Off to a great start. Base hit. Uh, he was playing very well when Giles wasn't in the lineup. Now he brings Giles in. 2-1. Pirates up on top. It's 3-1 Pirates, but men on first and third. Nobody out. Mike Williams. Oh, got Sammy. Next man up is Fred McGriff. McGriff have a little more success here. Good piece of that. Delano DeShields will score. Corey Patterson goes to third, so it's a 3-2 ball game. Next man up is Alex Gonzalez. Now, this is with the game on the line. First and third. Tying run is on third. No, sir! Jack Wilson! Pokey Reese! That takes chutzpah. Imagine if you don't make this double play, if it's Jack a tie Wilson, game. though, Brian, doesn't just use the glove and flip it to Pokey Reese, this play does not get made. Oh. It would not be quick enough. And look at the great stretch at the end of that by Kevin Young. I would have to say he's one of the best stretching first basemen in the major leagues right now. He did a full split like a gymnast the other day. That is a sensational game-ender. Jack Wilson again.